glory to God. Hallelujah. It's great to have you with me again today. And of course, I'm here to give you an encouragement through the Word of God. You know, we all need to be lifted up and encouraged at times. And these encouraging verses are filled with hope, comfort, and inspiration. I hope that these scriptures will lift your spirits today and every day of your life as you continue to meditate, declare them into your life and whatever situation that you might have, the, the word of God is truly will lift up, will bring victory, will bring hope and victory over your life amen so i pray that we as we continue to share the word of god with you not only for today but your entire life hallelujah and that's why it's so great to be able to be encouraged truly just reading the word of god because it gives us his spirit it is his spirit hallelujah and it gives life to us amen so in second corinthians says, chapter 12 verse 10 that is why for christ's sake i delight in weaknesses in results in hardships in persecutions in difficulties for when i am weak then i am strong because in my weakness because he lives in me I am strong he is my strength he give me the strength that I need to keep going and not to give up that is so great that you have someone with you all the time hallelujah to give you encouragement and strength and the victory that you need daily in your life isn't that wonderful and that's how God is but it's you know you have to make that first step that you will make him to be your Lord and Savior to have that relationship with him oh he is an awesome God because he is so perfect that you know he wants some everything good for you he's the only one that that can truly Hallelujah, help us in these difficult times, Lord to God. And also in Psalms chapter 16, verse 8, it says, I keep my eyes always on the Lord. With Him at my right hand, I shall not be shaken. Glory to God. You know that right hand represents His strength. He's so powerful that he, God will not let you go. He will hold you up. He would you know he will help you in times of those troubled times hallelujah so it says i keep my eyes always on the lord and with him at my right hand i shall not be shaken glory to god oh yes hallelujah it's so great to be able to just read the word of god and bring truth to our life who is our help in times of our troubled times in times of our you know difficult times and that's why it's so great to have that relationship with him that he will always be there hallelujah amen and of course also in jeremiah 29 11 to um, 13 and some of you have heard this verse before it says that for i know the plans i have for you declares the lord plans prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future hallelujah then you will call on me and come and pray to me and I will listen to you you will seek me and find me when you seek me with all your heart amen isn't that wonderful oh it's so great to read the word of the Lord to read the promises that he has for you for he's the only one 
that can really give you a, a hope and a good future. Hallelujah. But you must seek Him with all of your heart. Amen. Isn't that wonderful? That's a great promise, my people. So I pray that He will give you the desire to serve Him, to know Him as your Lord and Savior today. Hallelujah. This is the day, my friend, to make Him be your Lord and Savior because He has a wonderful plans for your life. He has a wonderful plans for your life. He wants to prosper you, my friend, and not to harm you. He wants to give you hope and future and a future, my friend. And then he says, then you, you will call on me and come and pray to me and he will listen to you. But you must seek him with all of your heart. Glory to God. I pray that you will continue to stay in this path, to continue seeking Him daily, meditating on His Word, and declare His Word upon your life. Hallelujah. Because the Word of God, hallelujah, shall not, you know, shall not return void to Him, but it shall fulfill what the word you have spoken to come to pass in the name of Jesus hallelujah and he honor his word my friend he honor his word glory to God hallelujah oh he is truly an awesome God he loves you so much that he wants you to be a part of that family so I pray that today that it's, you know, the word of God have spoken to you. Hallelujah. That you will make him be your Lord and Savior today. Hallelujah. Oh, he loves you so much that he gave his only begotten son to die for you, my friend. Hallelujah. Because of his love for you. He loves you so much that he gave the best for you my friend so I pray today that you will make him be your Lord and Savior ask him to come into your life hallelujah call upon his name for the word of God says that whoever whoever call upon his name and that name is Jesus my friend the name above all name hallelujah you will be saved glory to God he is truly for you, my friend. He will never leave you nor forsake you. He will always be there for you. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. And that's why I love him so much. And we continue one more time again next week. That we continue to give you the word of God, to encourage you, to give you hope and a future. Glory to God. And so today, be blessed through the word of God as I leave you once again with a word that will encourage you will give hope victory and a future in jesus mighty name i bless you with the blessings of god in your life amen and amen till we meet again god bless <music>